Hi, this is Cole Quinnell with the Ford Story here at the 2010 New York Auto Show. I'm here with Gil Portolatin. He is the Hybrid Applications Manager, and uh, we just introduced a car that he's been working on for quite some time, the 2011 Lincoln MKZ Hybrid. What does this car mean for the uh, Lincoln brand, uh, brand? Well, it's our first hybrid in the Lincoln brand. And not only that, as Alan and uh, Derek have stated, whatever foray we get into, we're going to be best in class. So here we are, we're introducing our first hybrid in the Lincoln. It's best fuel economy, at least 41 MPG city, and largest interior room, quietest, most fuel efficient, better better performance, 191 combined horsepower. So we're best in class. I mean, our closest competitor to 250, uh, we're six better than them, and we've got it all. Now, there, there have been some competitors in this market before, so you've got to come with some better uh, ammunition, if you will. Uh, what are some of the technologies that are going to help uh, deliver to the customer what they expect in a Lincoln Hybrid? Well, we first and foremost, we took nothing away from the customer. So all the options, all the features that our customers are normally used to, they're included. And great fuel economy. Then we went and added the smart gauge. Now, so the smart gauge, we lifted that technology from the Fusion and Milan hybrids. We applied it to the Lincoln, and then we took it one further. So I'm, I'm sure everyone's familiar with all the leaves. As you're driving efficiently, you grow leaves. Well, now we give you another reward. So as you're driving efficiently for long term, we start growing an apple blossom bud. So now you get a bud, and then the flower grows. So again, it's, it's just reinforcing good driving habits. So I'm driving well. I'm driving really good. We'll grow the leaves. Now I've been doing it for a long time. Now I give you a bud and I grow you a nice white apple blossom. Now for customers uh, that have never owned a hybrid before, this technology might seem a little bit intimidating. Do they need to do anything differently when they drive this car or, or what is the experience going to be like for them? A absolutely not. I mean the, the intent and how we've developed and designed our vehicles are the average customer can get in, turn the key and drive. And nothing magical. The only difference they might notice is we have silent key start. So when you hit the key, engine won't come on. With a little icon that says, ready to go. It also comes up with some verbiage that says, vehicle's ready to drive. Put it in D, step on the gas pedal, and away you go. Stop at your local station when you need to fill up. Not very often. <laughs> okay. Uh, take us through the technology on the car. What, what sets this apart from today's MKZ? Well, first and foremost, right, we've got our second generation nickel metal hydride battery, right, which we again introduced on the Fusion Milan. So it's more, more efficiency. I can pack 30% more energy in a cell that's smaller. So that allows me to bring the battery pack smaller, which means it's lighter, which again allows me to improve fuel economy. And again, we've got our Atkinson Cycle 2.5 liter engine. Again, we lifted that from the Fusion Milan but also we take advantage of all that technology. We refine it, and we've got a great calibration, which then allows you to drive at to 47 miles per hour in electric mode. And you collect the energy via our regen brake system. You put all that energy back into the battery, so you can drive electrically again. Now, how fast did you say you can drive in full electric mode? 47. Is anybody else able to do that today? No, we are the only one. I think our closest competitor is 25 or 30 thereabouts. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we're definitely the best. So, like I said, best fuel, quietest, biggest interior, and uh, just a great car all around. Gil, thanks for joining us. Cole Quinnell for the Ford Story. Come back to thefordstory.com to see more from the New York Auto Show.